Today we will discuss a Meiji period vase and cover from Japan. This object is displayed in Gallery 138. In this gallery, there are artworks from Asia, mostly Japan and China from the 19th century. There are scrolls, vases, masks, teapots, and more three-dimensional objects. This piece was created in the late 19th century during the Meiji period in Japan. It came to the museum in 1888 as a gift from Mrs. Harriet Muscroft and C.S. Muscroft Jr. The vase is 10 inches wide and 12 inches high. In general, we see a cream-colored vase decorated in enamel with Buddhist and Japanese figures. It has a small base, which gets larger toward the top of the object. The vase is covered by an ornately shaped lid with an abstracted pattern on it. Let's start at the top of the lid. The handle of the vase's cover is an exaggerated upside down teardrop shape. The cover narrows to a rounded gold neck before squaring off into a circular base. This lid has a similar shape to a large lotus bud on top of a cake resting on a plate. The cover is decorated with red, gold, and dark green diamond patterns. There are teal, white, and blue organic shapes overlying these diamond objects. On the handle of the lid, these organic shapes look like they could be clouds, but toward the base of the lid, they are more circular. The cover overlaps the top of the vase all the way around the piece. If we could touch this piece, we would feel slight textures outlining some of the gold shapes, as well as the textures of the gold dots that are seen along the lip of the lid. Just below the lid, more textured dots fill a band of pale blue that wraps around the vase. This blue band is bordered with gold. The body of the vase begins with a short neck that meets the lid. It widens to a more rounded form before narrowing slightly to a base. Imagine the shape of a man's neck, shoulders, chest, and waist. The diamond pattern found on the cover is repeated on the shoulders of the vase. Moving down the piece to the center front, we see a large haloed Buddha painted in shades of black and gray. This takes up the majority of the scene. He is draped in fabric as he sits cross-armed and cross-legged with only his right foot exposed. Next to this foot, there is a gold-colored statuette of a Buddhist figure seated in a lotus throne on a small pedestal. Looking at the other sides of the vase, we see smaller figures and two more larger figures, also in shades of black, gray, red, and gold. There are textured dotted golden clouds behind the whole scene that fade into the cream background. Information from the label helps us to identify the different figures pictured. This large face is boldly decorated with enamel painted images of Buddha, Kanon Bodhisattva, Dharma seen in red, and a divine priest with a halo. Accompanying these deities, but represented on a smaller scale, are a few lesser divinities or guardian figures native to Japan. The unusual combination of Buddhist and Japanese folk deities, as well as the distinctive color scheme and decorative patterns, demonstrate the innovative design of Japanese export ware created in Kyoto during the late 19th century. Looking at this piece, we can almost hear the Buddhist chanting in the background. 